A move by Ugandan President Yoweri Museveni to support the exclusion of lawmakers from paying some taxes is causing controversy. Lawmakers tabled a bill to exempt themselves from paying tax on their allowances after a court had ruled that they should start paying their dues. President Museveni had said exempting MPs from paying taxes would send a dangerous message. But he's now assented to the bill after twice sending it back to Parliament for review. Activists say it's unfortunate that the President backtracked on his earlier decision. We have very many members of Parliament. So the idea would have been much as you're very many, then you be taxed after being taxed. Some of the money can be ploughed back in other sectors. When you look at the budget framework paper for next year, sectors that have been cut, sectors like health, sectors like education and agriculture, they have been cut. And why are they being cut? Probably because we don't have enough money. Now in a situation where you don't have enough money and then you're exempting members of parliament not to pay tax. On top of their salaries, members of parliament receive allowances including health care, pensions, car grants and fuel. The allowances will no longer attract a levy. While some parliamentarians say they deserve better, a few have come out to condemn the tax exemption. The moment we, we failed to pay taxes as members of parliament, the message that we send to other citizens is that as long as you can avoid or, or evade tax and you get away with it, it's okay. So you are basically encouraging people to evade tax because as leaders, you are not being exemplary. And many ordinary Ugandans are disappointed. Already the country is struggling. We don't have enough money to run the country. The tax body has uh, said it is having a deficit. Last financial year, 2015, 2016, they recorded, they recorded the hugest deficit in five years. So if these guys want to exempt themselves from taxes, where will, we, where will government get money to run the country? And besides, I mean, everyone is paying taxes. Doctors are paying taxes. Teachers are paying taxes. Who are MPs? The new law takes effect next financial year. Campaigners say they will not give up. They intend to challenge the law in court. So celebrations for tax exemptions by members of parliament may be temporary if the courts decide to throw out the legislation. But until then, many Ugandans remain upset. Isabel Nakiria, CCTV in Kampala.